Hello everyone, nice to have you back for another episode of our 107 channel. Today's topic is how to determine precisely our true idle, but nota bene, not while sitting behind the steering wheel and checking the gauge in the cluster, this time we will use a digital multimeter with indication of frequency. We can, provided we do have a X11 test socket under the bonnet. A friend of mine told me about this, I will try it today. We'll get it done right after the introduction, please stay tuned. So here we are in the engine bay as mentioned before. We will determine the precise idle from here. What we need is a digital multimeter with a frequency indication. I will insert this black cable into the socket of number 2 of our X11 test socket box, which is ground. Black is ground. And then I insert the red cable into plus, which is socket number 1. Then I switch to Hertz on the dial of the digital multimeter, place it here and fire up the engine to see what the actual idle of my V8 5.6 engine is. Whatever the multimeter is telling you, you will have to multiplicate the figures shown by 15 for a V8, by 20 for a 6 cylinder and by 30 for a 4 cylinder engine. The table is shown below. The multimeter is now telling me an average number between a 50 and a 54. I now multiplicate these figures by 15 and I get a 867 rotations. This is the precise idle of this V8 engine. As mentioned before, multiplicate by 20 for a 6 cylinder and by 30 for a 4 cylinder. Nice and easy, like a walk in the park. This is how to determine your precise idle by using a digital multimeter and an X11 test socket box. Do not forget to switch to Hertz on the dial. 1, 2, 3. This is it for today. Thank you for watching. Hope this is useful for you. Looking forward to seeing you again with my next episode, my next video of our 107 channel. Take care everyone. You have a nice day.